Our next presenter is Michael Damschroeder. With over 30 years of experience as a director of design support, Michael focuses on project management and oversight of contracts, budgets related to design hours and fees, schedules and work plans. Notable projects include the Children's Museum of Indianapolis Sports Legend Experience, Indiana, uh, Indiana Soybean Alliance, Mississippi Children's Museum, and multiple Legoland theme parks. Sounds like a guy I'd like to get to know. Michael is also a member of the American Institute of Architects. Here's Michael and the Sports Legends Experience, bringing sports and history to children of all ages. Take it away, Michael. Hello, everyone. Well, thanks for that great introduction, Brian. Yes, yes, I'm a big kid at heart. Uh, we are Kramer Design and Production, and we are located on Ludlow Avenue, very close to the skyline that I'm sure you all remember. We specialize in design and production of fun experiences, theme parks, children's museums, science centers, history museums, corporate visitor centers, traveling outreach programs, anything that has a fun or educational story to tell. We are a group of made up of 10 of industrial graphics, interior architecture, marketing, and business operations, and we are 70% UC grads. After graduating from DAP in 1983, Tom Kramer started his career in the trade show design field, which evolved into the theme park design. In the early 1990s, Tom connected with the Children's Museum of Indianapolis. And in 1994, he stepped out on his own to design and produce their new ScienceWorks gallery. ScienceWorks became so popular that in an industry where galleries turn over every five years maximum, it lasted over 20 years before the Children's Museum renovated it in 2018. Since this project, KDP has become the Children's Museum go-to team for any creative boost they needed which brings us to the project I wanna share with you today. In 2010, the president of the Children's Museum called Tom and asked for ideas for turning their outdoor area, seven and a half acres of sport um, parking lots and scrubby outbuildings immediately adjacent to the building into something sports related. And that was literally all the direction he got. And this was their attempt at competing with theme parks for summertime attendance, which is notoriously no, notoriously low for children's museums, excuse me. From that phone call came a series of sketches like this, a 70 foot tall tree house themed like the Disney's Tree of Life, only this one was all about sports and you could climb all the way up into it. These sketches, seven years of blood and sweat and over $22 million resulted in the Riley Children's Health Sports Legends Experience at the Children's Museum of Indianapolis. That is a mouthful. So we just refer to it as SLE. KDP did the master planning of the entire experience, designed each individual sports area, each interactive, created all of the graphics components, and then oversaw the fabrication of all of the experience components, from the artwork on the basketball backboards to the fabrication and running of the pedal cars. Tom had one of his most rewarding points of his career, which you can see in the lower right-hand corner, when he got to visit fam famous golf designer Pete Dye at his home in Florida and worked with Pete to design the Pete Dye Golf Experience, a miniature golf course for kids. This project was over seven years start to finish, two years of construction and fabrication management, and two months of me personally living in Indianapolis and overseeing the final installation of all the experience components. The SLE opened on March 17th, 2018, and the most rewarding part was seeing the kids charge in on opening day and the parents dragging their kids from sport to sport saying, and when I played this, I blah, blah, blah. We have a couple of videos queued up here. The first is narrated by the president of the Children's Museum, so I hope we have audio, and used many of our sketches as advertisement and fundraising tools. The second is a time lapse of the construction and the aerials of the full site. And the third is that rewarding part when the kids come charging in who are sometimes passed by their parents on the way. The Children's Museum of Indianapolis is announcing plans to tackle the health and fitness challenges facing both children and adults. Together with Riley Children's Health at Indiana University Health, 
The Children's Museum of Indianapolis is creating the Riley Children's Health Sports Legends Experience. It will be located just to the north of the museum. Let's take a look at the plans. Hoosiers love basketball. Children and families will have the opportunity to shoot baskets on nine outdoor mini courts, so, featuring of course graduated there were hoops for toddlers uh, to adults. Possible, Special Indiana Pacers uh, and Fever if shot clock that and has passing some sort activities of will engage in visitors Indiana. of all ages. So you have basketball, a permanent which exhibit you just saw, in the Sports Legends football, Experience Pavilion will introduce racing, children and their soccer, families to what it takes to be a sports legend. Tennis, hard work training, Hockey, opportunity, and, and perseverance. Uh, Through hands-on activities, the, real stories, one. artifacts, and These memorabilia, of the visitors will learn more about these key sports and the heroes that make them great. Golf legends Pete and Alice Dye and have designed and created audio, their first mini golf experience, we which will replicate some of Pete's oh, world-famous okay. hole designs. Visitors will have the opportunity to learn the basics of golf using specially designed equipment. A separate toddler golf experience will give little ones the opportunity to enjoy the sport with oversized balls, clubs, and holes. In the football experience, children and families will have the opportunity to participate in an Indianapolis Colts pass and kick challenge, as well as practice offensive and defensive moves among full-size, famous Colts cutout wobbles that won't fall down. Using special 10 and under tennis equipment and court dimensions designed especially for children by the USTA, families will learn the basics of singles and doubles tennis. Baseball fans will have the opportunity to engage in a small scale baseball experience immersed in rich local and state baseball history. In the soccer experience, young children and adults will learn soccer fundamentals and participate in taking multiple shots on goal. In the hockey experience, visitors can use shooter tutors and learn about the basics of hockey. With two lanes for kids and two lanes for adults, visitors can drive their own human-powered pedal cars, representing IndyCar, NASCAR, and Hot Wheels cars. The Winter Circle experience provides a unique and fun photo opportunity. Special slotted pedal cars representing Top Fuel, Funny Car, and Pro Stock Dragsters will allow children and adults to experience the thrill of timed drag racing. Families can get fit together on this half mile jogging and running track, which features a durable, shock absorbent rubber composite surface. A special fitness path will provide children, families, adults, and seniors the opportunity to walk and exercise. Stations along the way will be family appropriate, containing both adult and youth exercise activities. This iconic sculpted 60-foot fantasy treehouse of sports climbing experience, inspired by Disney's Tree of Life, will allow children and families to climb in and among giant pieces of sports equipment while learning important facts about sports legends. Winding throughout the park, our Avenue of Champions will feature life-size sculptures of sports legends where visitors can pose for photo memories and learn about the accomplishments of favorite sports legends. Together with Riley Children's Health, the Children's Museum hopes to provide unique opportunities and resources to help families lead healthier lives by getting them involved in fun sports activities. This exciting experience will open in spring of 2018. We broke the news last month, and now it's time to break ground for the Riley Children's Health Sports Legends Experience at the Children's Museum of Indianapolis. 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 Indianapolis.
Okay, so besides this being entirely designed by UC graduates, there's another UC connection of, uh, in the basketball area, there's a life-size sculpture of Oscar Robertson because Oscar Robertson played uh, basketball in high school in Indianapolis. So the success of this project was overwhelming. The attendance of the Children's Museum has increased so much that they've had to hi hire way more staff than they anticipated needing. The sports equipment is getting so much use that some of it gets replaced monthly. The nubs on the basketballs are literally being completely worn off. So these are all the sorts of problems that are good ones to have. So thanks DAPEX team for putting on such a great event and thank you all for joining. Hope to see you soon at a UC event in person. Thank you, Michael Damschroeder. That was fantastic.